Hello everyone and welcome back. Today we went to the food bank and we got lots of great things. So let me show you what we this got. This looks super cute. Oh my gosh, Cody's going to love these. Little vanilla iced mini donuts. I'm just going to stick them in the freezer right now though so that until we're ready to eat those. Just stick those ones in the freezer. Hopefully there's room in here. Oh yeah, there's plenty of room. Right, we'll just set that in there. All right. We got some sourdough English muffins. Those look yummy. Multi-grain thins. Oh, and another pack here of those thins. Lots of bread here. Let's see what we got. White bread. Some more sandwich thins. Some more English muffins. Some Hawaiian sweet rolls, Sara Lee. Scooch those down there. A big bag of these rolls. Oh, I'm going to have to move some of this bread so I can get to the other stuff. All right, we got some Activa yogurt here. Strawberry and blueberry. It's great. Some grapes. Lemons. Oh, those look really nice. Sorry, I just don't want to take everything in the house and just bring some of it back out if I have to freeze it. Oh, and some red grapes. Mm, those look really good. I got some of those right now. Huh. Oh my gosh, they're crisp. I'm going to be eating chicken salad today. A couple of cucumbers here. Big old thing of mushrooms. Nice. These are turnips. I'm going to be so happy. I love turnips. I think they are. I gotta get these nuts and tie holes. Turnips on. and potatoes. Yes, sir. I wonder if you can bake a turnip like you bake a potato. Maybe that'll be my next adventure. Experimental cooking. Holy cow, some kind of dessert. Got knocked upside down. Cookies and cream. Um, looks like a little dessert cup. That looks good. I think Cody might like that. You never know. Teenagers are so weird. Like what they like and don't like. Oh, a chicken salad. Just said I was having chicken salad. Not this kind of chicken salad, but nice. Okay, some bananas. Don't know what this is. Some kind of fruit. It's wrapped up. I think it's a mango. I believe it's a mango. Oh, yummy. I love mango too. All right, I need to get these open. Little bag of tomatoes. I think I'm gonna make soup. It's so cold today. And I already told you about the bananas. All right, let me get all these produce put away and we'll see what else we got here. All right, in these two bags, it looks like it's all um, the fast food from Maverick, but it's been frozen. Um, so this is a sausage wrap. That looks delicious. Sausage, egg, and cheese bundle. And this is a sausage burrito. Sausage, egg and cheese, tornado, and this looks like banana bread, actually. It's delicious. And then here we got a pepper jack cheese tornado. Oh, those are some of my favorites. And a sausage, egg and cheese one. And this is a sausage burrito. They make it and have it in their hot case. And if they don't sell it within like a half hour, not a half hour, probably within a couple hours, then they have to get rid of it. So they think they just take it off and stick it in the freezer. Because it's so good. Um, a sausage, egg, and cheese bundle. That looks like just a sandwich. Oh my gosh, that's so good. And then this looks like a chocolate croissant. So that was all the fast food stuff from the Maverick. Which I'm sure we will eat some of that. But I don't know about all of it. What we don't eat, we'll definitely pass on to somebody who can. Alright, let's see what's in these boxes. Gosh, it's so much stuff. So much stuff. All right, so let's, I'm just going to start taking it out. So there's chili. More room. Okay. And these look like barbecue chips. Um, buffalo style chicken dinner kit. Kind of like hamburger helper, I, I guess. Yeah. And then a gluten-free angel food cake mix. Nice. 
And then, let's see, fancy sliced green beans. You could always use those. Diced tomatoes. I'll save those and use the fresh ones I just got. Ooh, chocolate shell. So you could dip your fresh fruit in that. Somebody you might like doing that. Okay, boil in the bag. Quino. Ooh, nice. I've only seen rice boil in the bag. Nice. Okay, cream of chicken soup. Um, craft muffin and cheese, black eyed peas. Oh my gosh, I haven't seen these in a can. Maybe, I, well, I'm probably not looking for them. Do you guys have any good recipes for these? They look amazing. I just, do you just put them in a soup maybe? Would you stir fry them with some onions and green beans maybe? I don't know. Comment your recipes. I would love to eat them beans. I just need to know how to make them. Asian style. Asian style. I don't know where I'm even reading that. <laughs> I'm just putting my own words out there, guys. Authentic Japanese Yudon artificial beef flavor. Never heard of those noodles. Oh, they're fat, kind of like fettuccine. I bet they're good. Okay. All right, let's see. What do we got here? Some protein bars. Clean protein bars. Never heard of these. 20 grams protein, 10 net carbs, 9 grams of fiber, no sugar alcohols. Peanut butter cookie dough. Mm, Cody might like that. She's not eating as low carb as we are, but um, the peanut butter cookie dough sounds amazing. And there's several of those. I bet they're delicious. Okay. A pancake and waffle mix. We'll definitely probably donate this to the local food box just because we won't use that. We use um, almond flour. Uh, our chili seasoning mix. That's great. Whole white potatoes. Mm. Okay, what do we have here? Some kind of butter. The lid's cracked, but... Bar what is that? I can't read. Barney Bear. California made. I don't know, some kind of butter. I'm thinking like peanut butter. And it doesn't have to be refrigerated, so that's nice. As long as the seal's not broke, it's good. Even though the lid's cracked, I can put it in a different jar. And the seal appears to be intact. I'm going to just check real quick. Yeah, the seal's intact, so that's good. That'll be fine. All right, and this looks like it's a jelly. Oh, yeah, grape jelly. Okay, so I'm going to put the things that we won't be able to use it back in here and take them to our local food box because I heard today it's pretty empty. So I may go through our cupboards and see things we're not going to use. We probably won't use these potatoes either because we do have a couple of those other ones. But yeah, all right, I still got a few more things to go through here. So I hurry, open the box and start taking it out. I saw this, I was like, yes, vinegar. I use a lot of this. Cleaning, cooking, so I was super excited. Even though it's dented in, I don't care. That's fine. And then there's this big roast that wasn't in the box. I don't know, maybe it's a roast. I'm not sure what it is. I think it's like little hams. What is it? Doesn't it look like ham, sliced ham? Oh my gosh, it's sliced ham, guys. It looks like it's sliced, like little pieces of hams that are just chopped up and put in here, vacuum sealed and frozen. Holy cow. I wonder if I should thaw it and then a little bit enough to freeze them individually. I think I'm going to, because we'll never eat that much all at one time, but if I let it thaw just enough that I can pop them apart, that might be the best way to store that. All right, back to this box. It wasn't full. Thank goodness, it's pretty heavy, but... Um, Bountiful Harvest Granola. That looks amazing. Coconut and all kinds of nuts and seeds. Mm. And this looks like some whole grain pasta. Chicken noodles, Cody's favorite. Gushers, also Cody's favorite. Um, ooh, raspberry lemonade. Mitch is liking this a little bit more. To cut back on not drinking as much diet soda, drink some flavored water. That is what we have here. Yeah. Semi sweet, is that what it is? Mini, semi sweet mini chocolate chips. Nice. These are so expensive now in the stores. Oh my gosh, a sleeve of Oreos. Cody's gonna be so thrilled. Last night, her blood sugar. We just couldn't keep it up, and she hadn't eaten anything. We, it was late, and Gosh, she was like 50 and dropping, and I ended up feeding her some frosting on a spoon, and she was not wanting it. 
So that'd be nice. Could have gave her an Oreo. All right, and a box of chai spice tea. That looks really good. We got to go back to those Tea Tuesdays. Okay, chunk light tuna in water. Sometimes my brain and mouth cannot function together. All right, I got two jars of peanut butter, um, cloud water, and plus immunity, blood orange and coconut. That sounds really good. Oh, there's a lot of that tuna. Holy cow. So there's 10 cans. Let me put that back. 10 cans of that tuna. Nice. Chunk plate tuna in water. That's a really good source of protein. All right, and then I have a bag here I need to untie. Looks like it's a tomato soup, tomato sauce, cream of mushroom soup, and chicken noodle soup. Nice. Oh my gosh, we got so much stuff. And this ham, holy cow. Do you guys know that that is our meat of choice for the holidays? I mean, turkeys are great, and we like turkey. I love roast turkey, sliced turkey, stuff like that. But Mitch loves ham. If he could have ham every other day, ham and pizza. That's all he would eat, ham and pizza. Oh, what a great blessing. We're so grateful for all the blessings we receive. We're grateful for each and every one of you. Thanks so much for watching. Be sure to like this video and share it with your friends if you want. Um, yeah, and we'll see you in our next video.